Hey everybody, welcome back to another Jackson Jet Setting Hotel Review. Today we are checking out the Four Points by Sheraton LAX. It's a Marriott Bonvoy property. It was the cheapest hotel that I could stay at near the airport during my one night layover in LA. So I wanted to check it out and see how it was. Uh, spoiler alert, it was pretty terrible. So we were able to catch the airport shuttle pretty quickly, which was great. Here's the lobby. I did notice that they were serving breakfast, but apparently elites weren't allowed to redeem for breakfast at this property, which makes no sense to me and a little annoying, but there you go. That's your fault for being loyal to Bonvoy, I guess. So I got 500 points uh, for my platinum elite benefit. But here's the room. So room itself, nothing fancy by any means. Uh, it was clean, so that's nice there. Really old bathroom with a uh, walk-in tub shower combo. And then some very old mattresses and a basically standard four points room. I did notice that the housekeeping decided to leave a uh, pillowcase on my bed without a pillow. Um, my bed had three pillows uh, instead of four. I think that was their intention. So overall, uh, not a great start to the stay here and then a runway view which was nice we were on the top floor of this tower but this hotel seems very very old and in need of a pretty nice renovation i will say that the uh, pool area looked really nice it was about 56 degrees so it did not hop in the pool by any means but the public spaces of the property felt a lot newer than the rooms themselves and then there was a nice little area to hang out that had some overhead windows, a uh, nice place to maybe read or wait for the shuttle over to the airport. So that part was definitely nice. And then I went exploring. There were a lot of conventions, uh, convention rooms at this hotel. It being an airport property, I imagine that it's uh, relatively reasonable compared to other hotels in the LA area. So I just walked around a little bit and checked out what I could find. Did see an old payphone bank there that's not in use. But this hotel opens up to uh, several different streets around LA, so it is pretty loud. I could hear like every plane take off. I could hear all the street noise. So if you want a quiet night's sleep, probably don't choose any hotel near LAX, but definitely not this one. And so while we walk, around the convention area again. This is the elevator bank that would take me up to my room, but if you move past that, it's actually a laundry room, which I felt like that was pretty nice. If you're on like a longer trip, you do have that option right at the hotel, which I always find really, really nice. So that's one positive there. And then here's the restaurant that served breakfast, but apparently not for elites. Uh, it was open late at 1 a.m. if Casey wanted to grab a drink or some dinner after a long flight, so that's nice there. The good news with this property, it does earn Marriott, Bonvoy points, and Elite Nights, so it's a quick and easy way to do that. So if you wanted to stay loyal to Marriott, there are a number of different Marriott's in the area. There's a full service Marriott, there's a Sheridan, there's a Weston, so a lot of options here. They do have a gift shop, which is nice, in case you're visiting LA and wanna pick up some souvenirs. And then there is a gym. It was small and the equipment seemed old, but honestly better than what I was expecting. So you can get a workout in here before your long flight. So that's a nice little option there for people. Overall, can't really recommend the four points unless other hotels in the area are just insanely overpriced compared to it. So thanks again for watching and we will post more videos in the future.